Hello, my beautiful Capricorns. Welcome to the next 72 hours. Reading for all of you. And this is a timeless reading, loves. Take it the way it comes and whatever message is coming in because these messages you need to hear right now and this moment. That's it, darlings. What's going on or what's coming up in the next 72 hours? For my Capricorns what are those messages or just the message okay this person is all done shuffling so let's see Capricorn Sun Moon Rising Science and Venus we have a two of Pentacles so it seems here for quite a while you've been in a back and forth back and forth situation and for some of you, you wanted to make a decision, but you didn't want to make a bad one or to regret a decision. But it seems here now the universe step in. The divine is here to help you to make the best decision you can. Temperance. Three of Swords. It's kind of like the decision you'll make still not be the one you do but it's gonna bring you freedom three of swords ten of swords yeah the devil freedom from someone or something that you should probably a long time to queen of wands five of wands it's kind of like make a decision to to do better for you or to move away from this energy. It's kind of like you're I'm hearing your ticket to freedom. Because nobody is going to make this decision for you but you. So to stay is going to feel like very bad. To go also feels bad, but to stay, nothing is going to change. But to go, a lot of things is going to change. I feel here there is a lot of things in the mix. A lot of people. And there's a lot more. So it could be a, a commitment with someone. It could be a family situation. Knight of Swords, yeah, somebody here has a temper. A temper, when I speak here about the temper, somebody here could kind of, um, you know, there is a physical abuse, there is a verbal abuse. So this person always have the bad words or the worst words they can say to whomever. And somebody here is not gonna be happy leaving what's this knight of swords here king of cups very manipulative person they could manipulate with the words they could say certain things wow and look at them very immature person they feel like they know know everything but they don't know nothing they feel like they do the right thing but they do nothing Wow, whoever is this person. Also, having the Knight of Swords, the Page, the King of Cups, the, the King of Wands, is like they, they have a lot of masks. So they could be a dual zodiac sign or someone who, who always kind of like try to flip the energies, try to, to definitely manipulate the situation always try to get their way or hope for their way to to get into their way wow yeah wow <laughs> this is kind of like you know the um, the person who always work things my way or the highway speaking of the emperor and the magician manipulation it's kind of a professional manipulator or someone who it's kind of they they gotta give some lessons to others too 
they always wants to be one step ahead but now I feel here they are not a step ahead okay let's see here what's the two of cups here queen of swords they may even say I love you I will I will work things out and but I feel here they they feel like losing you that's why they they try to give you everything and anything they can yeah the offer is legit don't get me wrong okay but it's kind of you are not gonna buy it there's something here like you can be legit as much as you want but I'm not gonna back up what I decide so for some of you you decided to do something and you're not gonna back up it's it's kind of like hurts but it's necessary it hurt hurts that it's necessary so look at here we have the the king and the queen of pentacles here it's kind of you you want the best but certain things are not gonna work any longer yeah it's like slowly slowly I'm moving forward it's like nothing is gonna stop me for some of you it's not the energy between you and this person but it's uh, the the work for some of you but somebody here definitely which it seems here it's you you made your decision and there's no back the king of wands speak to me six of swords yeah somebody here doesn't know how they can live without you or how they can bring you back how they can be friends or be be in a better situation with you yeah somebody here it's freeing themselves from a person or from a situation completely what else lovers somebody here is just kind of i gonna love myself and my new life so somebody here made the decision to move on to move on from someone and that's you that's you but it's kind of for some of you for some of you this this is happening or this happened already in the um, the gemini season or from gemini season to the leo season which is from June to August. Yeah, this is kind of a, a peace of mind or a peaceful me. Living a life which is peaceful, which is um, quiet. A life that I feel myself in a good place safe that's what I'm hearing and a life that I understand to put myself first what advice we have here five of Pentacles moon knight of wands and the world and the hermit for some of you you could had a very hard time to to leave something behind because you feel like you cannot stick to progress or to move forward with your life or stick with a new life but you finally conquer your fear or your fears somebody here could be married for a long time or been here for a long time with someone and didn't know how they will be by themselves or how they will make it and here you are spirit said your old life no more your new life 
welcome. You know it. The change was needed and you will love it. You definitely will love your new life. Whatever here you are changing into, you will absolutely love it. You will actually will never want to go back. And I feel here the divine, the universe will guide you to this change, to this new beginning. So Capricorn, very wise and beautiful decision. Not easy, indeed, but well worth it. So loves, I thank you so much for stopping by. I hope these messages are well welcome to you or to the energy you are going through. And of course, I'll see all of you next time. Bye for now.